Hey, if you're not familiar with this woman, you better. TK from LA, that's how I call it. <laughs> to Kenya Stafford. Um, one year later, fresh off a championship. And like you're the only starter back. Returning starter. Um, now that you've had a year to digest everything, the history and everything, um, just uh, what, what are your thoughts now? Um, I feel like it went by so fast, honestly. I feel like we were just in season. So I think, I mean, obviously the break in the spring is good, but I also think we worked on a lot of different things. Um, I'm honestly just excited for this season as well, just to do the same thing. So. You, you're only on, four, I think, four or five that came back here, here for copping, and then I know the, 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 the window came through and lo lost a few people, but we gained a few too. I mean, we have a whole new team this year, so basically a whole new team. So I do think it's going to be time for us to still come back and win, but not impossible. So I'm really excited. Um, I think we still have the capability and the potential to win again. So I'm really excited about the season. Um, you all picked second in the poll this year, but I know it doesn't matter too much with that. I don't really always look into it, but it makes sense sometimes. They're not, it's not the same returning team, so, you know, Howard is returning the same team, so it makes sense if they did that, but again, preseason doesn't really matter. Um, what is it you don't feel like? You all the chance the target's going to be on your back because everybody want to achieve what you all achieved last year. So is it, do you think it'll be more pressure going in or not? You think? I mean, I feel like we even had a target on our backs before we even won the championship. Um, each game, it seemed like everybody had a target on us. So I, I kind of expect the same thing this season. Um, I don't really feel pressure to win again, but I mean, I want to, but I don't feel pressure. Um, you all played Georgetown not too long ago. Um, I won two of the five. Um, what what do you take from this exhibition? What what do you all learn from this? Because it's for real Friday morning at 10 a.m. Right. Um, I do think this exhibition game gave a lot of insight. I think we got to really know what it's going to say to the team besides ourselves. So I do think that this exhibition allowed for like a lot of people to show up and see what people got, see the type of rotation we should do. So, I mean, I think, I think it was just a great opportunity to see, like, what we work on, what did we do well. So, my zone, it's your, your new teammates are very, very promising. Yeah. And, and I got to start with Sophia. I know. That's probably my favorite recruit that we got. So, I think she's just amazing. I think she's a pretty um, And I do think she feels her role pretty well. So, I mean, Kahia Kahi got a little slick with it too. Kahia, yeah. Kahi, I'm gonna well, yeah, learn these names go. sometime. I know. I knew her previously before coming into here because we're from the same area. So I already knew what she came in with. I know the area, California in general, is a really good state for volleyball. So I knew we would be getting a good recruit out of her. So I'm excited to be playing with her again too. And uh, I'm not, I can't. I, there's others I can't pronounce right now. We'll get to them eventually, but um, let's talk about your most your new your new teammates and how how uh, and how promising they look. Just uh, everybody sh everybody showed a little something something today. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, a lot of promising faces. I think ST did well today. Hitting. I think everybody showed up honestly. So I'm very excited. And most importantly, everybody stayed healthy. Yes. That's what we want. Healthy season. Um, you all have quite the challenge in the non-conference. Start starting this weekend, St. John's tournament, and on and on. We'll, we'll get into it as the season goes, obviously. But yeah. It, but you gotta start with St. John's. Yeah. 
Um, I think that would be a great tournament. I think we also have other good tournaments too, like in Duquesne. We have a Wyoming tournament. We play Utah State. A lot of good teams. I think that's just great. Honestly, for RPI too, but also I love playing competitive teams. So. And uh, in the obviously back to the Mihat coach said everybody's improved. So you know, it's 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 a battle to get through the conference and uh, again. <laughs> A new, a new challenge to defend the title that has never happened here at Cobbin, but this this is the first such mission in team history to uh, defend the right. net title. And how 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 do, how do you all approach it? Um, like I said, I don't feel pressure, and I'm I'm sure my other teammates don't feel pressure. I think if we approach it game by game basis and not just focused on like the end, but taking it one day at a time and growing and doing better and focusing on what we need to do. And I know, just play your sister. Like, you go back to Pittsburgh, but you don't. Y'all don't play yeah, them. But uh, right. I, I know you. You had. It, it, I know it was kind of mixed. I know y'all. Really yeah, didn't we didn't want to play each other. <laughs> and I guess that's set up. That's set up that way this year too. So uh, it looks like it. Um, yeah. But hopefully not. But it does look like it. Um, but I mean, it was a fun experience um, playing a, a top team. So you know. What did you actually? What did you learn from playing a top team like that last in the tournament? So that maybe this year, should y'all get through in there in the tournament, y'all can make some noise and knock somebody off. Yeah, what I learned is that we can hang with them. Like I felt like I can hang with them. Like we can hang with them. So that's what I felt like because I do believe us in the first set having a lead. So like that <clears throat> kind of showed me like. We can hang with these guys, but I also think it's like a matter of discipline. I think some some parts of our game, we didn't play our best game, and I think that kind of showed once we continue through the game. But um, that's my biggest learning experience, that we can hang with them. You just have to be able to believe it. So. Um, what what do you tell the fans coming in here this year? What, what can they expect to see cop and volleyball? High energy, um, competitiveness, and just like the will to win. So I'm very excited. I want to feel the whole crowds. I want everybody to see and see how well we play together and glue together. So you hear her, you see her. Takenya Stafford, aka TK from LA. Thank you so much, and I'll see y'all in New York. Yes.